today we're gonna make waffles. We have a waffle maker, a measuring cup, butter, eggs, baking powder, salt, flour, a bowl, coconut milk, a whisk, and a spatula. So, yeah. So first we're gonna preheat the waffle maker. When the lights are on, I mean it is uh, heating. So next we need our big bowl and a measuring cup. And, a measuring cup. Uh, and then we are gonna have to take, pour in three and a half deciliter of flour and two teaspoons of baking powder. And I forgot the teaspoon. And now we're gonna pour in one deciliter, two deciliter, third deciliter, Finally, we're gonna put the last half so yeah. And then we're gonna pour in two teaspoons of baking powder. One, two. And then we're gonna put away the things that we don't use anymore. Gonna put them over there. And then we're gonna make whisk the baking powder and the flour into a mixture after a few seconds of uh, whisking we're gonna pour in four deciliter of milk next we're gonna add two eggs to the wok to the mixture, but we don't want any eggshells. So we're gonna crack it into a separate bowl, small bowl, and then we're gonna pour it into, a, into the big bowl. And as you saw, I'm not so good at cracking eggs, but yeah, we have to crack another, so. And then we're gonna use 100 grams of butter. And uh, then like we're gonna use the measurements and we're gonna cut like 50, 50 and 50 because 50 plus 50 is 100. And then we're gonna just like cut the butter. Then we're gonna melt the butter into the microwave. Don't want to touch it with my hands so we put in here like so good we're gonna put the butter in the microwave we put it like that like that and then you want to turn it on so there 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 and now we have to just wait and we take it out of the microwave. First, we we'll let the butter cool off. Okay. Well, the butter is cool enough. We will mix the egg mixture with a fork. So, as you can see, I'm gonna mix it. We will mix it thoroughly so we don't see any egg yolks. Now when we have mixed the eggs, we're gonna add it to the waffle mix. So it's gonna like before you want to mix it, it you we have to you have to add the melted butter. Now you have to mix it. Don't forget to scrape the sides so these lumps of wear disappear. And then just mix it again. To make it tastier, we're gonna add some vanilla. And because I really like vanilla, I'm not gonna use a measuring cup. 
okay, maybe too much, but I like it. And we're gonna pour, add some uh, salt, because fun fact, salt makes a waffle more sweeter if you add it with uh, vanilla sugar. Mix it one last time and then the, your waffle batter is ready. So you take a pencil in the melted butter and coat the waffle maker with butter so the waffles don't stick. So now, now we're gonna take a ladle and take the pour the waffle batter waffle batter into the waffle maker but we don't want to cover the whole thing because else it's gonna like then it's gonna come out uh, when we have closed it and close it and now we're gonna let this cook until this turns green so we're gonna wait and hopefully our house doesn't burn down yeah now we're gonna open it and then you can decorate the waffle however you want and we're gonna do like this so you have seen much more but on the waffle of course so thank you for the waffle maker to heat up, we can dance, so. And then we need to clean the mess that we have made. So. Okay.